The lost city of Morn, which was built from ancient wreckage of the First Empire, can be found upon the Bone Fields. This once thriving city was once the shining gem of the ore trade between the Great Desert and the Southern Cities. After the fall of the Second Empire, Morn found great fortune as a city at the center of the trade routes, selling the metal mine from the ancient wreckage that is scattered over the Bone Fields. Being placed as it is, between the two halves of the United Cities gave more than an abundance of markets for their ore, bringing ever more slaves into their mines. As their vast fortune grew, so did the slave trade and the number of slaves themselves. Morn's mining operations became vast as it gathered more wealth from the trade routes and slave markets. As time passed, it seemed as though there would be no end to the fortunes of Morn. With all the wealth it seemed Morn overlooked one thing, the slaves themselves, as the slaves were forced into a life of drudgery in the mines and felt the stinging whip of their overseers, they plotted revolt. The great mistake of Morn was that the only thing that was greater than their fortune was the number of slaves within their city, and so the great slave revolt started. None know how it started, but when it came, it came like a thunderbolt from a clear sky leaving the city of Morn in ruin, and forever its great fortune lost to all. The horrors suffered by the city were not done then, as a great beast had come to Morn, savaging all who got in its way. In the end it took the tech hunters, and their proficient skills honed upon the ancient ruins of the old world, to cage this mighty beast, and even then two of their number were slain. Though lost to the United Cities, Morn did not die, some inhabitants have survived to continue on in the wreckage of their lost city, and as time went on, the ever-wandering tech hunters took up shop in Morn as a resupply station for their kind, and so the great dangers of the bone fields are ever scratching at their door, and the people of Morn have carried on, and maybe one day for their greatness to return to this lost city.